Greetings, uh, blessed love to each and all. This is Halima with Timeless Roots Media. Today is March 6th and I returned to the United States just four days ago on the 2nd. Um, I'm delighted that the weather is pretty moderate, uh, having left just because of the weather, remembering what a bad winter we had last year. Uh, but anyway, now that it's so moderate, I decided to return early. Um, it's good to be back and um, forward with uh, a little bit of what we covered while we were in Trinidad. It was a, a pleasure and a business as well as pleasure journey and uh, we took some time out wherever we go. We just take our camera and pick up what's happening locally. And of course, if you're in Trinidad and Tobago or Brazil for the carnival events, uh, you might as well don't just never forget to bring your camera. Uh, we just pick up some film. As I mentioned, every year we attend a, a, an annual event at the Queen's Hall, uh, which is given by Bishop Anastasia's uh, alumni. And uh, that, that venue, that lineup, uh, the venue is beautiful. It's outdoors and it starts in the afternoon and goes all the way into the evening. It's all inclusive. And just great people as well as great food and wonderful atmosphere. The best weather you want to be in the middle of February. Uh, anyway, that lineup of uh, artists that we were able to uh, pick up and uh, some of you may remember but fortunately we lost our YouTube channel uh, after four years of uh, so many artists interviews and documentaries and so forth uh, but you know can't go back always moving forward so we were able to begin building again and that's uh, added three very good uh, videos from the Trinidad trip as well as Barbados uh, that lineup at the Queen's Hall on Sunday Dimanche Gras which is uh, a friend's where this uh, the Sunday before the carnival actually launches off in full swing on the Monday and Tuesday before Ash Wednesday. Uh, that was on Sunday, the, um, the March Bar, and again, the venue was beautiful. We picked up two or three of the artists on that lineup. Uh, there was uh, Three Canal, um, a great performance, always full energy. They're a rap show group. Rap show is a genre that was uh, pretty much uh, born and molded like the steel drums and calypso in Trinidad, which is a combination of uh, calypso and a rap, which is just a high energy beat. And I just love rap, so I mean, you can't really sit when you hear it. And uh, although it's a little, it's a bit political and it's very conscious and they bring you the message with, with that really high energy beat. So that was Three Canal. Uh, and then following was uh, just the one and only magnificent David Rudder. Uh, David, as a few of you may remember, many would remember, uh, Trini to the Bone. Yes, Trini to the Bone. And that was uh, like a national anthem, is what he refers to it as. Um, everyone remembers and sings along with that one. And a uh, great performance again with David Rudder. That's also up now on our YouTube channel. Uh, part two of Trinidad Carnival 2012. And last but not least, uh, a band that I wasn't really familiar with until I saw them down in Trinidad uh, last year and this year. Uh, it's just a great combination of brass and percussion and uh, just the, the keyboard giving you a little bit of a steel drum sound. So very unique. They're called uh, Trevenor Brass. And uh, who performed with them this year? None other than the this year's Chutney Soka the Monarch. Uh, for you who are not from Trinidad or don't understand, uh, Chutney being an Indian influence in the Calypso genre, so they have a, a new genre called Chutney Soka. And that again, too, you can't sit, won't want to sit uh, with the Tasa sound, it has the Indian Tasa drums as well. Uh, so KI was performing really uh, tiny and he moves all over the stage and whines. I mean, you really want to know, you want to see what whining is. He's kind of reminiscent of Marshall Montano, the one and only monarch. Uh, do be a uh, Soka Monarch as well as uh, other other areas, but uh, you really don't want to miss this uh, footage. So uh, join us there on our YouTube channel, and again, I'm just saying hello and a shout out to everyone uh, since I'm coming forward and uh, trying to catch up and, and get back into uh, my routine, uh, bringing news and views from uh, globally, uh, not just where we travel, but uh, generally of interest for culturally conscious media. Uh, so we've changed uh, our name for the Thomas channel uh, and also the website uh, late last year, uh, this year to Thomas Roots Media Culturally Conscious Global Exchanges. And in doing so, um, we'd like to stay representative of that by bringing you uh, 
a spicy combination of uh, many genres of music and uh, individuals from wherever we travel globally. So give thanks for listening and for tuning in and for also for your patience because we know that uh, we've lost a lot of footage and as some of you who visited and seen that the channel was removed by the user, it was one of those technical glitches and I do apologize for that. But again, moving forward, never going back, we're moving forward with high energy and keeping you up to date with Timeless Roots Media. Uh, do visit us at www.timelessrootsmedia.com as well as uh, visit us uh, at dot .web.com sorry, and, uh, and youtube.com Timeless I. So um, give thanks, blessed love to each of you wherever you may be, and keep it lit every time. This is Halima Amhara Solomon for Timeless Roots Media saying one love and rest of life.